everybody, what is up? My name is Astrocat, and welcome back to Your Turn to Die. We're playing as KG, and we're gonna continue and figure out what happened, and I'm totally not at all scared. I'm so curious as to why he wanted us to stay away. I want to know what happened, and also I don't want to know what happened because I'm very scared. All right, so we left Kyutaro and Safalan over here. There's the torso of a Domidori inside the AI Seaver. So how many? We did a bit. We did. Ah, oh, that looks like it hurts. That's quite a deep wound. Who did that? Oh my, honey. Yeah, feels like staying put hurts more. Look, I know how you feel. Wait, is this in here? No. Okay, so I guess it's time to move. Oh my god, I didn't even notice. It's it's uh it's KG down here. That's awesome. We do know where the doll's head is, so and the key card. Oh, so we know KG asked for Sarah, right? That was KG, we think, over the intercom. I think we can get her to give it up. Mabel holds Midori's head, I'm moving her face frozen in a happy expression. Midori's head. Mm, obtained Midori's head. Sorry, Mabel. <gasps> Are you sure? I feel kind of bad. Midori's an evil man. He's not a good fit for Mabel. That is true. Well, okay. Come on, let's go back. We're worried about you, Dodo, right? Yeah. If he's oogling her, I'll never stand for it. That's that's her concern. Oh, I love you, my. Yeah, okay. Sorry about that. But you're too good for me, Dory. That's true. Will function if charged. A letter noted its left eye was repaired. All right. So I guess we'll bring that to. It's fallen. Go inside. Oh, they're gone. Kyutaro and Cephalon aren't here. Where'd you go, Kyutaro? Are they in the back? The back of where? What did you? I mean, I don't really know what else we can do other than attach it. What will this do? I suppose it wouldn't move, huh? Glad it's just a doll. But what does this have to do with the banquet? My guess is to fill the seven coffins. Yeah, so we need the seven dumb meat? Question mark? Yeah, coffin Midori's and can't be left empty either. Oh, so this doll will be his substitute. That's right, but maybe even without this thing, we can have somebody substitute. What are you doing? Do you all really intend to do the banquet? I mean, is the banquet the only way we can clear the game with everyone alive? It's nothing so kind. It's the most awful game. You'll be killed. Someone will. Absolutely. Oh, no. N no way. That's not what we heard. Mabel said. At any rate, don't get in the coffins. There are any other ways to fall in? Well, if we do nothing, the dummy's collars will explode. Helps with the odds of saving him a little. We gotta do it. Oh, cute tunnel. In that case, please at least do this. As much as possible, try to keep it a secret who's in the coffins. The surveillance system is disabled currently. Now is your chance. Even obscuring just one person will help. It's a tough request. Disguising ourselves could be dangerous, but I feel like Midori has to have a way of monitoring the Midori dolls. Let's dress up and edit the coffin so we can keep- That's not what I meant. Your ideas are messed up, man! Never mind him, how about this? Yeah, okay. We put the Midori doll in the coffin! And Keiji will hide in a room somewhere! Yeah, okay. Then, Midori not seeing him anywhere will think Keiji's inside, right? I get you a diversion tactic. How interesting. But, but, there's one more thing you need. It's... A key card? Thanks for telling us. Uh, I see. Yes, I imagine it'll be dead. No worries, I can arrange for that. Unless it's not the key card. I sure as my camera was like really bright. I hope that's a little bit better. Really? Yep, now let's assemble everything we need. And if we get the Midori doll personality with the AI super, we'll have a perfect substitute ready to go. Our deception plan should work, right, Safali? Uh, ah, there's one other important thing. That doll head is out of battery. It's got a power too? Talk about a short-lived celebration. But 
but if you use the charger and for five. For real? You got one of those? Alright, I'm sure the others will bring us the ID card. So if we can just charge the set. Let's do it! There's no more reason to suspect everything. It's scary, but I've never felt such optimism. Hope, sure it's important. Yeah, it is. Please be careful. If you need treatment, come back here. Okay. Hey, Keiji. Sorry, but you could drop by the cemetery? Hmm? Well, alright. Cemetery. Okay. Sure. Why? Yeah, let me sit myself down for a sec. What's wrong? This is weird. Keiji, better plan from earlier. Right, the deception using Midori's doll. Fool the enemy first to save your allies. Keiji, can we make it seem like you got executed in the coffin? What are you saying, Kyutaro? Deceive everyone, including. Oh, I'm. Wait, I'm curious. I, I'm sorry, that was really random. I just like processed deceive everyone. I want to see what the other dialogue option was. Okay. Deceive everyone, eh? Wonderful work. You're in such high spirits! It's simple, I tell ya. Put the dolls lying here in coffins and wait till the execution device starts. Genji, you'll go up above and charge the head. When you come back, use the eye receiver to make another Midori. Then just swap what's inside the coffins and you can vanish, Genji. Just stop it! I feel bad for Sarah and everyone! Yeah, they just opened up the lid, right? That's obviously not what I mean! We'll make something happen for the lid. What? Genji! Now'd be a good time to use that lantern you got. Smart thing. You thought I was being really smart. Oh, what's this? You see it? They change color. This material's gonna let us pull a trick. How do you know that? Did you hear something from Sifala? But even if we lock the lid, how do you intend to get the, to the upper floor without anyone noticing? I got a plan. Wait, so is this why Mai was so insistent on making sure that we all stayed together? Was that part of the plan and that's why she was so nervous about it? I wait to engage in the upper floor alone! Cute Dotto. Can I trust in this plan? You bet! Fine, I'll do it too. Once we pull it off, we'll have to give everyone an apology. Alright, once you're ready, give me a holler. I'll give you the detailed plan then. Anything else to look at? I don't think so, but just to be safe. Looks like there's not much else we can do. Now when you're ready to execute the plan, Keiji. How's your wound dessert? Don't sweat it, I'm alright. Okay, can we use the lantern on it? So hey, cute that I want to talk about your lost memories. Yeah, memories? Yep, just a bit of counseling. Guess you'd be one for police questioning, eh? But, well... It's a good time as any. Let's give it one last go. I was afraid, you know, like maybe taking a serious look would dig out some outrageous memory. Just might. Well, who knows what's gonna happen? Jump me through it, KG. Okay, uh, we actually get to do this. We didn't get to use it on KG, did we? Memory I wondered about was when I was in the hospital. I told you when we met that I got injured and couldn't play baseball for a while, right? Never look back on that time, thinking it was in the past. But it's a real unclear memory. It just feels like there's more to it. All right, I'll try and have him remember. All right, obviously Midori, flowers, bed. There's no bed. There's two picture frames in the real memory. Okay, colored wheelchair. Oh, head wound. Okay, outside. Nothing on the TV. Curtains different. Can't see the other building. All right. Um, there's light on the ceiling. Maybe this. Let's point out the other suffers. Could you remember this part? Let's see, I think there was a, it was a fluorescent light with regular LEDs or something. Can you say for certain it wasn't an incandescent light? Is that important, Keiji? Nope, couldn't matter less. Relevant topics aside, let's move on. <laughs> Alright, the silhouette across the, across the way, maybe this? Could you remember this part some more? Yeah, there was the old man in the other ward. We'd make eye contact, but I never greeted him. And every day, give me this glare that said, I'm your elder, greet me first, whippersnapper! Worth a fine rivalry. It ain't a joke! I was down in the dumps then. Well, doesn't seem to be a suspicious individual. Alright, does the sign say the same thing? Scroll like sign. Yeah. Yeah, that had some outrageous words written on it. The sound mind makes a sound body. That unscientific poster be in there. I saw the limits of medicine. Nice. Maybe I'll put that up myself. 
I mean, you can do what you like, I suppose. <laughs> Nothing all that suspicious here. Alright, what about the light? I hardly remember anything about it. It was just some built-in equipment. Might have stared at it absentmindedly sometimes. It's just a regular light. Didn't glow rainbow colors or anything. Why would it? That'd be one wild hospital. Well, nothing suspicious here. Yep, what about the flowers? The flowers from a teammate came to visit. I don't know nothing about types of flowers. And the nurse took care of all the water. You didn't happen to say, mistake them for vegetables and eat them. I didn't eat them! <laughs> well, nothing on there, it seems. <laughs> okay. This tree. Sure. Yep, it was a fun tree. That's it. Huh? I feel like it was a... What? A, some... Is that a kind of tree? Probably. Yeah. Doesn't, even, doesn't sound really right to me. Well, I'm not suspicious here, so that's fine. Bed. Big bed. The bed? I think it's pretty normal. Yeah, no way, I'm misremembering a little. Oh, dang, I did not notice that. I had them lower the head of the bed. Since it's so big, I was risking falling off. It ain't a laughing matter if a leg injury worsens, it's deadly for a player's career. I couldn't let the guys at the orphanage hear that I retired because I fell out of bed. That'd be a funny headline. KG, you gonna take this seriously or what? Nothing like that happened. You were discharged from the hospital just fine, right? Mm -hmm. Keep that up. Yeah, should be. What? That's weird. Blue sky. That's right. It's super clear day. Perfect baseball weather. Except I couldn't move. First time I ever hated a blue sky. Like, you dumbass sky. Right. What kind of lad is that? It's like some page out of a kid's youth. Guess I shouldn't just say what I'm thinking. Probably not. You have the tendency to say really stupid things. Okay, switches on the wall. That's a tricky one. They were, you know, normal light switches and such. Guessing they were on the wall so you could use them without having to get out of bed. You went clicking through them when you were bored, didn't you? What am I, kid? If I did that, the doctor get worried and come running. Hmm, quite the adult. You would press it, wouldn't you, KG? You have shown that you like pressing stupid buttons. Is this building anything? Okay, hold back curtain. I guess we'll start over there. Could you remember this part somewhere? Curtain? You just take interest in the weirdest places, huh? Nothing out of interest there. No, wait. It was. I think the curtain was half closed so that you couldn't see it from the other room. That room had kids in it, see? They were baseball lovers. It isn't deep enough to even know about me. Children, athletes are like superheroes. That's right, you understand, don't you? That's kind of cute, not gonna lie. I couldn't let those sick kids in the hospital see me like that. Oh, he didn't want them to see their hero discouraged. He's so sweet. Alright. Television. Remember this place more. You got it. The TV, yeah. I got an idea about that. It's a little embarrassing, but I couldn't watch TV no more. Huh? Why's that? When I turn on the TV, like it or not, there'd be news programs going. And I catch sight of some baseball news. It wasn't the TV you couldn't watch with baseball. I'm heartless, I swear. Can't even cheer for my teammates. Watching baseball, it was pure suffering. I don't blame you. Ah, uh, yeah, you feel. But you can't watch detective shows no more either. Sure, yes, we'll say that. Around that time, I was thinking about death a lot more than baseball. Keep that up. Oh my god. Oh my god. Sorry, that one just kind of hit out of nowhere. I uh, don't go telling nobody. Kyutaro. Oh my god, I don't even know what the right response to that is. Kyutaro's face, maybe this. Could you remember your own face more? Now that's a weird question, but let's see. Come to think of it, something was different. Now what was it? Back then, I had. Bandages! There were bandages wrapped around my head! That ain't right! Was it not just my leg that got injured? What's your head injured do? Nah. My eyes. I lost nearly all my eyesight then! Oh, that's scary. What's going on here? That's true, why can I see now? Maybe your treatment or surgeries went well. That can't be it. Why have I got no memory of that? If they were erased, it's quite a mystery. I want to remember quick everything! Oh, that's scary. Okay. This chair. Yep, it was a wooden chair. Come to think, 
No, that can't be it. It was comfier than that. Comfier. That's right, because it was a wheelchair. I completely forgot. My leg injury was worse than I thought. Seems like it takes some time to treat. Yeah. Fatal long time for a second string player itching to get back on the pro baseball. Must have been feeling awfully impatient. Yeah, sports people typically would be. It's baseball bat and ornament. Maybe this. Could you remember this part some more? Right, that, huh? I think I might have remembered something. That ornament. Actually, I threw it out. It was a gift from a supporter, but it was painful to leave it out. Can't hide nothing from you, can I? Oh, cute, Toto. You got it? What? Wanted anything to do with baseball out of sight. So I tossed it. Just pretended I'd forgotten. Then and now, I'm a weak person. Only a strong person can admit they're weak. Thank you, KG. You're handling this so well. Both of you, honestly. This photo stand on the left, yes. Right, nothing to it. It's a photo of the guys at the orphanage. Didn't have nothing to do with baseball, but I'd play with them and teach them. This photo full of smiles, it always propped me up. Propped him up, huh? I wonder if it put more pressure on it sometimes. Probably. Alright, anything else other than... I don't think so. Midori. Y yeah, I think that lady was... Huh? No! Hold on, it was a man! He was a fair bit taller than that, and also... His face. That's right. He had the same face as Midori. That ain't possible! You telling me I met Midori there? Stay calm. You sure of that? Yeah, now that I think about it, this gotta be. I met Midori and talked with him. Feels like I could discuss my retirement. You were able to open up to him? He seems very good at getting people to open up to him. You got it. Retirement. Losing both his legs and his eyesight. No doubt he lose confidence to continue. I remember it. The whole thing. My real memory looked like this. I took a major injury that threatened my career. If I got it during practice, that'd be one thing, but it was a careless, unrelated ex. Stuck in a hospital room, I worried day after day. Then, that nurse came along. Should I just die? I got no value left. I'd be better off dying, I tell ya. Oh my god. Oh, I knew these characters were well-written, and I've talked about how well-written they all are. And I've talked before about how Kyutaro not that he wasn't well written, but just that I didn't have all that much going for me. And in like one scene. Oh my god. It's alright, you'll be back on the field soon. How long's that gonna take? Days, months, no, a year? How can I be play baseball with these legs and these eyes? Oh. I apologize. Sorry. Just quit trying to console me. There's a way. Eh? Do you know the Asuna Val? If you sign your name on a certain form, you can have any one wish granted. What did they do to him? I ain't gonna believe some silly pipe dream. Well, that's just the official story. Rumor has it you can be given experimental illegal treatments. But if you're just going to die otherwise, what do you think? You piece of garbage. I don't- I can't even call you a piece of human garbage, because you're not human. In truth, I have one of the forms here. I'll leave it here for you, Mr. Kyutaro. A silly pipe dream. But ain't my life always been chasing dreams? My eyes, my legs, I didn't get them through a buff ward means. They were compensation for signing that form! This was Kyutaro's erased memory. God. Ouch. Damn What kind of athlete am I? I never really believed in playing fair from the start, did I? You can't blame yourself for that. Oh my god. Okay. I'm scared for what they might have done to him. Whether he's really him anymore. I'm ready. No, I'm not. I'm saving. I'm ready. Alright, let's do it. Cute that Bye. And so me and Miles support Keiichi from the lower floor here. Okay! I'll go to the upper floor and judge him and do what he's Time to start! Don't you dare get seen, Keiichi! Okay. Now then, I need to go to the elevator. The elevator. 
Alright. Keiji, we'll turn on the power to the elevator. When we do, the people on the upper floor will surely come down, so... At the same time, you'll go up in the other elevator so you can pass them right by. I do miss plan. Hope it works out. Anyway, I'll wait here for now. Kutero and Mai can decide the timing. Okay. I've taken a while. Still nothing. Can't exactly leave the spot, though. That sound. Elevator seems to be working. Okay, it's back up. Let's get on. Okay. Wait here for a little. Oh, this is so nerve-wracking. Uh... What are on it? Get out quickly! We must not spare him a second! Oh, good. They've already come down. Press the button. The elevator started moving. Okay. Nobody knows I'm here, right? Search the charge room without letting anyone see me. Okay. <laughs> A strange machine in the middle of the room. No way is this. Carmada is moving. Am I? Okay, no. Oh, you look like you're seeing a corpse. You're alive. Ah, and whose fault it is do you think that I'm like this? Thank you. I was able to get out of the coffin safely. Ha! Good. So, like, why are you all by yourself? What about Mai? You seen her? I have. She's safe. She's down below. Oh, yeah? <laughs> and I guess we'll meet up. There's everybody else. They're all headed down. It's just me here. Of course, I might be at my limit soon. Just going to then. I should tell him about the banquet. Okay. Serious with that? Sure am. Well, ain't that perfect, huh? <laughs> it would just be wiped out in the end anyhow. We could save you in a single one. We gotta take that bet. Thank you, Kuramata. You. You've gotten pretty kind, huh? Ah, shut up! Well, whatever. I'm feeling good, I'll tell you this too. Floormaster meets her doppelganger. They die. Oh? What's up? Mm, nothing. Be grateful, because that was info only I had. This isn't good. Now I can't tell him about Midori's head. Okay. It's a charger. I think it's so huge, but only has enough for one full charge. One full charge. Why does he know that? Don't tell me. You used it? Yeah. Yeah. Only half, though. What? You think I had to hoard it all for myself? Shit! So there's still half. Can I look around? My mission. Mission. It doesn't seem like there's any other options, really, other than doing it. Hmm? Well, now, aren't these? Put in the charger instruction manual. We just gotta use it, I guess. No choice. Connected Midori's head to the charger. Well, hey, that's... Hey, that Midori's head! Did you kill him? Wrong. This is a dog's head. In. Well, screw with me! Then why are you spending precious battery on that thing? Ugh. I wanna try... Calm down. I'll explain. We can use the AIC for the machine that burned you guys to create another Midori. What? That doesn't make any damn sense! Karamata crawls closer. If you make another damn Midori! Ain't that making a doppelganger? Karmata crawls closer. What did I do? You're trying to kill Midori, aren't you? Did we save you? Even my wounds are because of you. And yet you're gonna forsake us. No, this is just for the banquet. I know. That's gotta be a lie. Listen to me. Stop that right now. Quit it. Get away. You traitor. Oh boy. Hi. Hi, old buddy, old pal. Old hallucination. Gagey. <sighs> You're gonna kill me. Again? That's wrong! No, it's not. You can't save anyone. Uh, I- I- All that matters to you is yourself. Just don't touch me! Murderer? I SAID DON'T TOUCH ME!
Did I kill him? He's Gigi. Don't forsake them. Oh, Cromata! Please. I would forsake anyone. Cromata's lying on the ground. Is he okay? He'll be okay. Right? <sighs> I charged it. Now I just have to get back to the lower floor. Calm down. The plan is also no one sees me. That's gotta be KG! Oh. Oh no. So it's not him. It's friendly policeman on the air. How's everybody doing? What? I'd love to explain everything, but unfortunately there's no time. You can hear my voice, I got a request for you. Bring the ID card to the classroom. I need Sarah to do it for her to come along. I'm counting on you. What the hell was that? That was my voice. Damn it. What do I do? <sighs> Screw you, game. Nobody here. What in the world is going on? Oh, friend Maru? How do you feel, KG? Friend Maru? Did you make that broadcast? Yep. Found a nice voice changer function. Got some business with me. I might. Hand over Midori's head. What is your goal, Ranmaru? Not seeing where you're going with this. I heard it all over the transceiver. You killed Kuramata, KG! I didn't kill him. I trusted you. Sarah, too. She trusted you the most. Do you really believe this, Ranmaru? But look at you with scrutiny and it's clear. KG, you... You're with Asunaru, aren't you? What? Don't get what you mean. Sarah, she... She signed the consent form. Yeah, I kind of forgot we did that. She was brought here by someone's wish. Put into a desperate situation for someone's sake. And at last she signed the invitation. KG, are you the one who brought Sarah here? He's not, is he? Why would it be me? And Maru, it's just jealousy. You just want to be the closest to her, the one who protects her, isn't that right? No! I don't matter in this! I just want to help Sarah! You can't be that person. Not you as a doll, or me as a murderer. I really like this. Like, I don't because I'm freaking out. But I really like this as a concept. Of the two of them fighting over who gets to protect Sarah, but also, like, acknowledging that- Ugh, oh, KG, that's such a good line. Of course I know that. No, come on! Hand over Midori's head! Wait, somebody's coming. Hide. Sarah- KG! There's no one here. Why'd Sarah come here? What are you planning? When Maru held out his left hand. Ugh. What's this? KG, are you there? Don't come here, Sarah! That voice! It's you, isn't it, KG? Stay away. Are you the one who called for me? Listen to me! If you survived, then why? Don't come over here, Sarah! Ah! What? Sarah! Stay with us, Sarah! Sarah! What the- what- what is Ranmaru doing? Time to lock you away. Boy, what the frick are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? <sighs> I don't understand. Oh. 
Back to Sarah? Where am I? You okay? You came too, Sarah! Eh? Kyuto! You're safe! I'm so really- Ow! Ow! Hey, don't overdo getting up. <laughs> How energetic for having been passed out. I missed you guys, but also, where's KG? Here, Big Sarah. You want water, real? I see. I lost consciousness from some kind of electric shock. Thank goodness. If you had any consciousness. Oh, Kana. Kana. That's right. Where's the ID card? I don't see it anywhere. Nothing we can do about it. But still, you got to meet back up with Kyutaro, so don't be sad. Why? Then where's KG? He wasn't anywhere, right? What? Unfortunately, we just found you alone collapsed in the classroom. Renmaru, where did you put KG? Where is KG? Renmaru? Now, do not be saddened, Sarah Chidoin. We do have good news. The banquet. There is a way in which we may clear this game and survive alongside the dummies. Banquet? Muscle Corella knows all about it. Woof. Yeah, but you might want to gather everybody. And Mar said he'd bring everybody here, but... So this is where you are. Rise and shine, Sarah Senpai. Hurry up and get on with this explanation. You ain't with Renmaru? And also, I haven't seen Kuramata anywhere. Did he finally die? Pinako. Not right now. That's not a reaction for it. It's just a joke. Kai used to joke like that. I'm sorry. I not he, he, he just used to have questionable jokes. Hold on. Has nobody gone to check on him? Uh, I'm sure he's fine. I mean, he's charging up. Ain't it obvious? I'm more stubborn than that. Thank goodness! You seriously worried us! Ah, some reception I'm getting. No, but Renmaru Kageyama and Keiji Shinogi have assembled. Keiji, eh? Wonder where he could be. Nothing for it. Let's get the banquet ready ahead of him. Everybody assemble in the cemetery. Okay. What if I just want to find KG and I don't care about that? Tell me if I would like to know where KG is. So if I miss KG. I guess we go to the cemetery. Alright, everybody prepared? Are we starting already? There's no time! But always repairing Maple right now! If we don't hurry, he'll finish and... Oh, I finished ages ago. Good music. Bad person. I hate you. Glad I made it in time. Midori, how's the other kid a gad beat? As if that's anything new. It's true! Since years ago, he's... Oh, I'm so glad you finally remembered! Oh, the devotion I've put forth! The effort I gave to grant your wishes! I created for Alice an opportunity to kill me. I gave Kyutaro a body that could keep playing the sport he so loves. You gave him a body, huh? That sounds so suspicious. And to this day, Gein, your mother is healthy and looking after you just as you wished. <laughs> what a happy bunch. What about us is happy? We are all tricked by your offers. You took advantage of our feelings for others, our pain and emotions. And you saw our happiness, our lives, our futures. Kana, we wish for her sister's happiness. I see. Which is why you said you wanted your sister's wish granted. Do you know what she answered? <laughs> What's that smile mean? I want to know. We don't need to hear it. <laughs> what did she say? Could you be quiet, Miss Sarah? I want to hear Kana's opinion. Kana! If you have fears now, I will never tell you. I want to know. What did Sister answer? <laughs> Such a good big sister. She said, I want Kana to meet her real family. Okay. That wish. Of course, I granted that too, didn't I? What does that mean? 
I reunited with you with someone much like you. Kind, weak, and cowardly. was adopted and a new cookie I wanted her to meet her oh my god that means kinda <laughs> okay she lost not just her sister but her brother too this does not feel real I thought as much you knew as much as much of a liar as it was his affection wasn't a lie. He always protected Kana when she couldn't do anything. No, even now. When she's about to give in, she sees them. <laughs> kind hallucinations of her sister and soul. That's what hallucinations. Kana is weak. Surely she shouldn't be looking at them. She should stand firm on her feet. Look forward. Treat everyone as precious. <laughs> he looks so soft there. <laughs> That's what hurts the most. We've never seen him smile like that. So that the two of them can disappear in peace. <laughs> so that she can say, I'm alright. <laughs> down properly. Toys these days sure are complex. Toys! Just then something flew in from outside the cemetery. What? Oh god, okay. I'm still processing the fact that that just happened. Ugh! And Mario! He was getting worthless ideas too. Midori took the ID card from Ren Mario. G give it back! What were you doing with that ID card? Why? Because he's the villain who knocked down Miss Sarah. Grand Mario betrayed you all. That's wrong. Sarah. Damn it. It can't be anything after all. So, I at least want it to be Sarah's salvation. God, screw this game! I thought if I put the joy eye in me... Oh my god, Renmaru, no, that's not- that's not the way to do it. I- I understand your intentions, but you- that's not- That's why you're using the AI Seeker. How hilarious! To even give up your own consciousness for her. Midori! Yes, yes, I'm tired of talking now. Come on in, Maple has been reborn! Sorrowful AI. Run away, everyone. Oh, that's a sound. <laughs> What's even going on here? Huh? I still have some powerful AIs in her. She may look hideous, but I think it's what's on the inside that counts. I'm gonna slaughter all you bastards together! My, my, see so you're my prey. Sneering me. Oh, guys, Yori. Oh, I don't like it. Now go, Maple! Run wild till your battery gives out! Her battery? 
We're fighting this? That's totally not even Maple anymore. Listen, at this point, our only option is to run down her battery. Find a way to make her do things that consume a lot of power. Okay. Okay, the angry I started up. No mercy for you bastards! I'll kill you! You're dead! He's giving you guys a serious glare. Okay. He has strong hatred of humans. If we can simulate that somehow. Okay. And unfortunately, I think this is probably going to be the best time to save. And as much as I really want to tackle Maple right now, I'm going to leave that for next time. Because I'm already at my recording limit and I have a con over this weekend. So I know I'm not going to have a ton of time to edit and I don't want to give myself too much of a project. Even though I really want to go into the Maple fight. But oh my god. Oh my god, Shin and Connor are siblings. Shin and Connor are siblings. Shin and Connor are actually siblings. Not that non- Oh my god. Oh my god. Um, I feel like the like that even it hasn't even fully hit me yet. I'm gonna go cry about that for a couple hours probably. I don't even have anything else to say. Everything else seems so unimportant by comparison, and obviously not. It's like so many things happen this episode. Oh my god. Oh, this game is just pain and suffering every two seconds. I think I've I've really solidified my list for now, and like there's some that are like so close that I could probably move them around. Honestly, Joe and Sarah being my number one and two are things that like that's not going to change ever, I don't think. And then Gein, Kai, and Now are three, four, and five. But honestly, they're all so close that some days I like Now is at the top and Gein's at the bottom or sometimes Kai is at the top. You know, it just it all kind of flips around in my head. Then Shin and Kana are pretty solidly six and seven. Alice is pretty solidly eight at this point. Sometimes him and KG flip, but uh, Rico, I just I haven't interacted with her in so long. I feel like my brain's going to be so confused when I go back and I play the, the, the Rico route because I'm going to be like, oh my God, Rico's here and I have character to like, like I love her, but I just haven't seen her in so long. And then Mishima and Kyutaro, who I do absolutely love. And then I think my favorite doll still has to be Ren Maru, though he's kind of freaking me out right now. In a sweet but creepy way, if that makes sense. Sweet but endearing but creepy. Uh, Mai being second. I love Mai. Her and Ren Maru are very closely tied for like my- are almost very- like are really close to both being like my favorite. And then Anzu. And then Hinako, Kuramata, and Hayasaka are kind of like that group down there of like, I love them all, but it kind of, the order flips. Like right now I would say I'd probably put Hayasaka at six just because we haven't interacted with him much. I, f I don't know why I have such an attachment to Hinako. Like she's been kind of being a jerk the whole time, but for some reason I feel fond of her. I don't know what's up with that. So I guess that places Kuramata in between them. Who knows? And anyways, I've had a, I've had a couple people ask if I were to put the dolls in what would like the grand master list be. Um, and I have to say, I feel like most of the dolls still rank under a lot of the main cast for me. I feel like Mishima Kyutaro level are kind of like where most of the ones are. Mai and Renmaru, I feel like the only ones who could really like really breach into that list. And I'd still only put them around KG Alice level, if that makes sense. So like, I love them both very much, but I think they'd be like slightly under Alice, maybe a little above KG, depending on the day. So who knows? That's where my list is right now. I have so much to process. I want to cry. Anyways, without further ado, I'm gonna go. If you guys are interested in talking to me about this game or any of the other games I play, please feel free to join the Discord link in the description of this video on the about page of my channel. I would love to have you there. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you all next time. Bye. Mm -hmm. <laughs>